Good day and greetings from the Great White North. My name is Prickly Poo and welcome to day 115 of A Year of Change. Um, things are sort of creeping up on us. Um, I realize that we're getting very close to the one-third mark of what we're doing. Um, so there are some times I feel like it's going a little too fast <laughs> um, and that we're sort of pushing too far ahead, but then I think, no, we're going slow enough that I'm still able to do stuff, so... Um, it's, uh, yeah, uh, a little weird. But um, I just figured I would bring that up just because it's sort of, we're, well, five days from now, we're going to be hitting day 120, which is pretty much one-third of the way through. Uh, but we still have a long way to go, so I'm sure that we're going to be okay by the end of it. Um, I just sort of worry that we're going either too fast, I'd rather go too slow, um, but I think we're doing okay. But anyway... I figured I would just sort of let that out there, just to let you know. But, today being Tuesday, um, normally we add a another YouTuber in there. Um, today is going to be a little bit different. Um, we're still adding a new person, but not for the same reasons that we've added others. Um, in the past, I've added people that um, either have done weight loss vlogs before, and they've sort of, you know, gone on to other things, or we've added people that are currently doing them, either they're just starting out, or they've been doing it for a while. Um, I have some people that, you know, have come back because of it. Um, this one, it, it's sort of the same, but it's not the same. That doesn't make any sense. Um, anyway, uh, person's name is Jared, his uh, user ID is jrod311. So, um, a couple of years ago, he started doing a weight loss vlog, and pretty much the same thing that we all do, you know, trying really hard and following along with stuff and doing what he can, um, and made quite a few of them, and then gradually sort of fell by the wayside. And he came back um, a couple of months ago and sort of changed the tone of the channel. Um, I mean, it gradually sort of been... A little bit of everything anyway throughout the the past couple of years but um in it he addressed that he was the channel was going sort of in a different direction he'd been streaming on twitch for a long time and um he wasn't going to be doing the weight loss vlogs and it wasn't sort of a no i'm giving up it doesn't matter anyway um it's just that at this stage what he's doing um and he does address it in uh, his videos is that it's it's a very personal thing and he's not to that stage where he's ready to share yet so normally we would sort of add someone in there and see, you know, try to bring them back in and say, oh, you should definitely put that up there. But where they've already addressed it, it's going to be a little bit different. So the video I've actually put up um, in the playlist that you can take a look at is one from a year ago. Um, pretty much when, I mean, he had sort of continued on um, doing the weight loss vlog for a while, but got to that point where we all get to where you just can't really take it anymore um, and that you've reached that breaking point and the reason why I put that in there is not to depress you or anything but just to show that this does happen to everyone it's happened to me it's happened to every one of you and at some point we get to a stage where we just we don't know what to do anymore that we've tried e everything that we can think of and it just it hasn't taken effect for whatever reason, whether it's our own willpower or the fact that it's something that's unfeasible at the time, something that's unrealistic that you can't really maintain for a long period, whatever the reason is, we've all gotten to that stage where we just we just we don't know what to do and we need a hand. So that's what the video that's in there um, is. But his follow up, which is actually almost a full year later, um, when he first came back a couple of months ago. Um, he seems much, much better all the way around. Um, things seem to be going much better for him, uh, health wise and, you know, emotionally, everything just seems to sort of be turning around for him. And in his return video, which I would suggest that you go up and take a look at as well, he does address the fact that he's not going to be doing a weight loss vlog for a while anyway. Um, he did say that he wasn't going to be continuing on with them. He didn't set a time frame or anything like that. And... Because of the program that he's going through right now, um, it's something that 
the, the public forum really isn't there for it. So I thought in this situation, um, I still want to send out that invitation. Um, we've added quite a few people over the past few weeks, and it's we are starting to grow. And there's sort of, I don't want to get to a point where we're now, well, you aren't going to do a weight loss log, so we don't want to talk to you. Because I do want this to be open for everybody. And we have some that are still putting up videos. We have some that have started to return, and that's going to start, you know, that is going to pick up speed as well. Um, it's going to take some time for people to get sort of back into that groove as well. But with this, I think that we should also be extending out invitations to people that maybe not necessarily are doing the same thing that we are doing, um, whether they've done it in the past or not, or that they're planning on doing it, things like that. But part of what we're trying to build here is just to send out invitations to people to say that you're not alone out there, that we've gone through the same stuff. Maybe not exactly, but we're going through it now. We're, we're doing the same struggles. We're having the same issues. We've had the same failures and we felt that same sense of desperation. And that more of a support group than anything, that we're here so that they can go and they can see what we're trying to do and they can look at the different YouTubers that we've added over the past few weeks and maybe get something from that. Even if they're only watching it every once in a while, you know, once a month they come in and they sort of scan through and they grab one and it, you know, at the very least that they know that they're just not all by themselves. And I know this sounds a little bit weird because there are just hundreds of weight loss vlogs out there. Um, but I mean, there is that common thread that goes through all of them where they do want to help other people, but it's a little bit different when you have someone that's actually, you know, like a group of people that are out there and trying to be interactive and saying, you know, no, contact us. If you're having issues, there's groups that we have. They're either on Facebook, for those of you that have Facebook, which I don't, or my fitness pal, that they can go and they can watch your progress as you're doing it instead of just sort of coming back in and saying, oh, look, I've done all my stuff and I'm finished and here's how I did it in a 10 minute video. Um, so this one isn't really exactly the, a way of saying, no, you need to start doing this again. You know, I think that what you can contribute is going to be great. There is that contribution aspect of everything that we all sort of have. Um, but there's also part of it that we need to be able to say to people, it's okay if you don't want to come back right away. Um, I we did that with Nina and thankfully she has started to come back and started doing more videos and things like that. Um, but it's not something that's going to be a requirement that we can't, shouldn't be saying, well, unless you're contributing something, then you can't come into our group, which I can't imagine anybody's going to do. Um, but it's just, sometimes it's one of those things that, you know, people just sort of take on themselves and they think, well, I don't really want to do this because I don't feel like I contribute enough. Um, whether or not, it doesn't matter how many times someone says, no, it's fine, just come in. Just It's like going to someone's house and saying, I didn't bring anything. I'm like, no, it's fine, just come on in. And you're like, I didn't bring anything. I feel like a shit. So I want to be able to sort of extend that out, um, not just for people that are watching, because I know that we sort of showcase different YouTubers and things like that, but just the people that are out there as well that are just sort of sitting back and maybe watching these and not, commenting or not taking part in my fitness pal and not sort of engaging that way i don't want it to feel as if well i've got nothing really to bring so you know i can't really contribute i can't really partake i can't be part of this group or part of the community and i really want to sort of quash that right away that the people that i'm adding on here um the groups of people that we've got so far and the more that are going to be growing over the next i guess for eight months. There we go. <laughs> I'm trying to do 12 divided by three really quickly in my head. I'm like, what's two thirds of 12? So there you go. Magnificent math skills for you. Um, and again, lost my train of thought. But the people that we're going to be adding and things like that, these are sort of the core people that I've looked at and thought, you know, they've gone through the same stuff. They're going through it now. They can either use our help or they can contribute something. Or in some cases, just seem to need to know that there are people out there that understand and that are gaining something from what they've done either it's in the past or something that they're doing now so 
Um, which is actually another really interesting thing because um, I do have a Twitch account, which I very rarely use. Um, the idea was eventually that you know we'll be able to do some live streaming with conversations and things like that. Um, and so I went up and I was actually watching him on um, on Twitch last night, and just as a guest. And I thought, you know what, I'm gonna I'm gonna join him because I know I'm going to send this guy an email. Um, so, very entertaining, by the way. If you get a chance, go up and see it. His uh, channel is more aimed at gaming now, but there's that that same ease and openness that was in his weight loss vlog is still there um, in the stream, and it's very entertaining. Um, I don't even watch TV anymore. So, um, anyway, I logged in and f started following there, um, and immediately he said hello and everything, you know, so there's still that engagement, the very personal aspect of it, which I think we all have uh, one way or the other. Um, it's And I mean, he's got plenty of people following him. Um, so it's not as if he's just sort of, oh, oh there's number 2,000 and 500, whatever he has. Um, he's got quite a few. But um, just that same atmosphere is there that we've seen in all the weight loss vlogs. And he's got it in his videos as well that there is that and i mean i think this is going to sound cliche and it might be stereotypical but i find it's really difficult um and very very rare to find a fat person that's mean we are just inherently not mean and i think what that is that we're so used to people making fun of us and being paranoid about it whether or not they're talking about us and overhearing comments and you know just being bombarded with abuse all the time from a very, very young age that we really, I mean, I think we may have talked about this before as well, pretty sure that we did, um, that we sort of overcompensate and our personalities come through that way. And I've only really ever met one that was just a horrible human being um, all the way around. I mean, there are, I'm sure there are plenty of, of us out there, but um, it was just the one person that you just like, God, you of all the people, you should really be sort of putting your best foot forward personality-wise. And you're just a horrible person all the way around. And this is why nobody likes you. Anyway, that's a story for another time, I think. Um, but anyway, that I think it's because we have to sort of not, well, maybe overcompensate. Um, and maybe that's where that comes from. Like, oh, fat people are jolly. <laughs> Fuck off. Um, oh, I think my fingers are out of frame. There we go. That's better. Um, and for those of you um, in the UK, hey... So it's it may be cliched, but again, there's a reason a cliche becomes a cliche. Um, but that personality did come through. It was very friendly. He said hi, and I was able to say hello back. So um, which is now just going to be a little creepy because now he's going to get an email from one of his new followers. I'm not trying to be a stalker um, and just start joining and then signing up and doing likes and subscribing and then going. Can I smell your hair? So. Um, but I would urge you go up, take a look at his videos. Um, some of the, he still has them posted on there. Um, they're from a couple of years ago, but they are you know we still can gain quite a bit from it. Um, and if you do get a chance, you can go up and take a look at his uh, Twitch stream as well. Um, he's just prolific at it, like every single night. So um, just if you're in the mood for some entertainment, so this week is sort of the things I have planned for Friday as well. It's more it's going to be a little bit lighter this weekend um, or this week. Uh, we've had you know, week after week of, you know, changes in heavy topics and sometimes depressing things and the documentaries that we watch and things like that. There, I understand there's going to come a point where you're just going, I just, I'm watching the same thing over and over and I feel bad enough about myself. So I'm trying to get this week to be a little bit lighter and this fits very well into that. Um, so if you're in the mood for some just quick entertainment that, you know, you can sit and watch and laugh, certainly go up and take a look. Um, but I'm going to add his video in there as well, um, which the video I'm actually choosing is one from, like I say, a year ago when he sort of hit that wall. Um, but you can go through and look at his follow-up one from this May of 2015, depending on when you're watching it. And there's just, there's a world of difference. So whatever he is doing for himself is working, um, whether it's physically or emotionally or psychologically. It's working for him. He seems to be in a much better frame of mind. It's just, it's a completely different person. So um, I'm hoping that, you know, we can send out an invitation, extend that out to him and let him know that you know, we are here. Um, if he decides to do a weight loss vlog again, um, then that's something that he'll do in his own time. 
Um, it's not something that is a requirement. It's not something that I feel that, oh, no, well, if they aren't going to do that, I'm not going to put them up here. Um, we did the same, or I said the same thing to Nina. Just, you know, we yes, we would love to have you come back. We'd love to have you contribute, but it's not a requirement for it. You know, we're still there. The main focus of this was to create a support system for people and a sense of community that they could go to, not someplace that say, well, if you're not contributing enough, then we're kicking you out. So I want to sort of send that out to everybody. Um, and those of you that are watching and feel, oh, I don't have a YouTube channel. I'm not doing anything. I'm not contributing anything. I don't have a vlog or anything else. It doesn't matter. It's not what we're here for. Um, the main reason why I try to add more people is so that it's they're not getting everything from one source. People aren't just coming here and watching something and then saying, oh, well, that's what I need to do. Because it's not going to work for everybody. You're going to be able to go up and you're going to be able to see Amy's channel. And you're going to be able to say, okay, well, that might work for me. You're going to be able to see Nina's channel and say, that might work for me. Um, you know, there's there are a number of different ones you can go. With. I think the majority of the people that we have actually are women. <laughs> now, think about it. There's Kimonica. Um, she's still going strong and she's made a tremendous amount of progress that way. Um, there's Jody that we've added a couple of weeks ago, and you can watch that. Maybe that aspect is going to work for you best um, with his stuff. And that you're going to be able to pick from a number of different sources and find out what works best for you. And that's the one that you're going to gravitate to. And it's just nice to have sort of a creating a hub where people can go and look at all the different things that are out there. And and we may not have hit upon it yet. You might be watching this and going, yeah, none of these are really doing anything for me. You know, eventually we're going to find someone that has a different approach that's going to work for them. It's something that, you know, it's going to be that one thing that they're going to look at and say, that's what I want to do. I'm going to stick to that. And that's what's going to make the difference. So, anyway, I keep trying to say that I'm going to cut these down, and we're at... Oh, it's not too bad. Okay, I'm going to try to cut this out before 20 minutes are up. <laughs> so, um, but anyway, go up, take a look at his video. Uh, take a look at his follow-up video, um, which I'm, I didn't add in there. Um, but it's, I really sort of wanted to have that, that moment where we've, that we've all had, where he's just sort of at an impasse and just doesn't know what to do. Um, but then go look at his follow-up from May of 2015, um, at this stage a couple of months ago, and his triumphant return to YouTube, I would say, and just see the, the vast difference. So whatever he is doing, you know, I hope that he keeps up with it. And as per usual, I'm going to send him a quick email, let him know, and, you know, just send that invitation out to him. Um, but also I want to send it out to you guys that if you're watching this, even if it's just sort of in passing, uh, which at this stage you're watching now 15 minutes in, um, just... To let you know that it's it's fine if you're not adding something new. If you're coming here just for the help, that's what we're here for. And it does sort of go through that, through all of these videos and all these vloggers, that there is that desire to help other people because we know what it's like. And we know how tough it is to just try and try and try and not feel like there's anyone out there that's going to sort of not necessarily guide you, but just to be there and pat you on the shoulder and take your hand and say, you know what, you're not alone out there. So that's out there for everyone as well. But I'm going to cut this off because now we're going to start bleeding into 20 minutes and I really want to avoid that. So thank you very much for watching the video. If you liked it, please poke the like button for me. In the meantime, keep yourself warm and fuzzy and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.